Hello, my name is Tim Martin. Welcome to Net101. Uh, I'd like to give you a couple of tips if you're thinking of employing somebody um, to help you out with social media uh, and the like. Um, the traditional way that people apply for jobs, and many still do, is uh, the standard uh, response to a job ad, uh, a CV uh, attachment, and hopefully they get a first interview. But the first thing I would be doing as an employer is to check out their uh, credentials online, their digital chops. I wouldn't be going to the Facebook account because that should be buttoned down and if it's not buttoned down, if they've got an open account, that's, that's probably not a good look, good start to begin with. But I would certainly be looking for a blog. I would look for a demonstration that this person is not just comfortable with the base mechanics of how stuff works and, and getting stuff up online and posting, but actually has the ability to write uh, and write well, write with clarity. Um, right with a little bit of personality. Personality is such an important aspect of social media and we don't just want a, a, a matron there, we want a real person that can exude uh, trust and credibility and as I say has a little bit of personality to boot. So a blog is important. The next thing I'd be looking for is YouTube. I mean video is such an important uh, component of, of uh, online marketing and communications these days and I'd like to see demonstration that the person um, has a YouTube account and is uploading uh, YouTube videos. In fact it would be even better if they apply for the job by sending you a link uh, for uh, their application which is in video format. It certainly has the advantage you can get a lot more insight into somebody's personality rather than just uh, reading a, a static page in a CV. Um, I would look to see that they had Twitter. Uh, now it's not to say that you want or are in a position to use Twitter in your own organisation but anyone who's in that space, social media space, uh, needs to be around Twitter. It is an important platform and I'd like to see somebody uh, there. I'd also like to, to look at the people that they're following and, uh, and look at the sort of tweets uh, that they put out to, to get a sense of you know, the comfort in the space. And then you've got peripheral uh, social media properties, things that they might be doing just for the fun of it, might not have any business application at this point. And we're talking the likes of uh, things like Instagram, uh, Pinterest, uh, Vine. And these are all indicators that the person is comfortable not just on one platform, but they are experimenting, they're trying out the cross section of things. And that sort of experimental curiosity, I think, is something that will go a long way um, if, if somebody like that were to join your organization. So yes, CV is fine, first interview is fine, background check is fine, but I would be asking for their online portfolio.